it seems obvious wealth can be printed. Those at central banks around the world think this though. These so-called experts in economics actually know a negative amount about the subject. They can define terms and make formulas, but that's it. Honestly, they don't understand the subject. They fooled you if you think they did. It's time to admit you've been fooled. It's impossible for wealth to be printed. Understanding the business cycle isn't special knowledge that is only possessed by a few. They pretend they can print wealth. However, this just makes goods more expensive. It might give the appearance of more money in the short term, but you're harmed. If the supply of money goes up, demand for money goes up. Not in the sense that people want more money, but demand is someone's willingness to hold cash. There is no boom and bust in a free market. Yes, people will make mistakes, but there's no large-scale distortions. The amount saved or consumed is based on some one's time preference. The interest rate is determined by the masses' time preference. A low interest rate means people are generally saving right now. A higher interest rate means people are generally consuming right now. Distortions are created when the interest rate and time preference don't line up. A common tactic of the state is to lower the interest rate. People have demonstrated they're consuming now, but the low interest rate has encouraged people to borrow now. The new loans go to purchasing resources where they aren't demanded. These loans generally go to longer-term projects. The people may not be consuming as much when these new projects are completed. The projects are unprofitable, and bankruptcies occur economy-wide. Printing more paper tickets doesn't make society richer. The early receivers and large debtors do see a benefit. The state is always the early receiver and is the largest debtor. They're the ones who benefit and use propaganda to convince you to go along with this. This will appear beneficial in the short term, but the masses are misled and the seeds for disaster have been planted. The errors will be noticed and the malinvestment must be liquidated.